See, okay. one thing, like I just said, mm-hmm. one thing we lack is that we don't challenge anything that has been accepted mm-hmm. in uh, society. Mm-hmm. Importantly, in leadership, we don't criticize or even reevaluate the actions, the decisions mm-hmm. of our past leaders, mm-hmm. especially our leaders who got us independence. Yes. Okay. See, I say this, I will say this for everybody to, to hear. I've said this several times. The people who have filled Africa are in my generation. We didn't do what we needed to do to sustain the moment, momentum that our independence leaders started building. Okay, They did what they did based on the limited information or knowledge that they had okay it was literally from bush to office exactly oh yeah very very good so i i i accept the fact that okay they had limited knowledge but in my generation see we have no excuse we don't have any excuse okay Mm -hmm. but then Mm -hmm. we for me we went to school we came out and very very few of us decided to go in to public service mm-hmm. okay many of us wanted to do things for us okay mm-hmm. now i'm not saying that nobody should no but very few of us wanted to continue walking that road for for our country's liberation mm-hmm. okay now when i use use the word liberation is a little bit different from a lot of people but see what i'm saying is that we are so i always use the word selfish mm-hmm. all we cared about is us mm-hmm. but not about the our society in general mm-hmm. okay so, but first, what I want us to talk about now is this. I want us, I, I, want, I ask you, why do we find it difficult to even say, okay, these people got something wrong? Because until we, we admit that they got something wrong, we will not do anything to fix them. Ooh. What a can of worms you've opened up. 